Hi guys, how are you? I hope you are doing well. This is my first spoken video. You know, I used to share silent vlogs, but today I decided to speak in this video. To be honest, I'm a bit excited. I hope you like it. Today, my cousin and I are going to Gazelle Art House. Um, I saw this place on the internet. It caught my interest and I want to visit. The gallery offers a rich program of exhibitions. Um, including sculpture, photography, painting, video, performance and virtual reality in Bostier, London and Baku locations. There were many artworks here and what's interesting is that each of them had its own unique music they had placed headphones next to each artwork and by putting on the headphones we could listen to the music that corresponded to each piece. This place is a two-story art center and we really enjoyed it. Listening to the music of each artwork was really interesting. Some of them were very fun, while others were quite depressing. Perhaps that was exactly the emotions the artist wanted to convey. Each artwork has its own story. For example, this raw canvas piece is a portal of emotions as viewed by a child. For children, emotions are confusing and overwhelming. Only when we grow older, we we'll learn to identify, deal and suppress them. After touring the gallery, we realized that we were hungry and decided to grab something to eat. Before heading to the restaurant, I wanted to show you a bit of the city center. If you have never been to Baku, you should definitely visit. My cousin has been living with her family in Turkey for a while, so she hasn't had Azerbaijani food for a long time. And she said she missed Döner the most. So we decided to have Döner. This is Nizami street, which is the city's most famous street. Here you can find many shops and restaurants and of course pigeons too. The view is really beautiful, but we wouldn't want to be attacked by pigeons, will we?
And finally, we arrive at the restaurant. This is my favorite donut restaurant. Their donuts are really, really delicious. My cousin ordered donut, but this time I ordered a Caesar roll instead of donut. The taste was really good, but the portion could have been a bit larger. After having dinner, we were craving something sweet, so we decided to have waffle. We went to another cafe and ordered a waffle and coffee. Both the restaurant's interior and the waffle were really great. The waffle was quite delicious and crispy. We ordered waffle um, with, with chocolate and bananas on top. If you would like, you can also add strawberries. And we finish it in just 10 minutes. Thank you for watching my vlog. I hope you, you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like the video and leave a comment. Bye bye.